Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Jenna. Thank you so much for stopping by and taking the time out of your day to watch this video. I would love it if you liked and subscribed down below if you want. And I post every single Tuesdays. Today's video is a very, very exciting one because it is the start of my Christmas stuff. <laughs> It is the start of my Christmas videos and I'm so, so excited. Today's video is about unexpected gift ideas for men in your life. Brother, husband, boyfriend, whoever it is. Hopefully this list I've compiled gives you some ideas of what to get the men in your life. So it took me a really, really long time to come up with this list. Um... By the way, next week's video is unexpected gifts for women, so stay tuned for that. And then I have some other Christmas content as well. Also, one thing I want to do is a disclaimer. Of course, these categories I'm talking about, you can use them um, for men and for women. And just putting it inside a men category just because I need to put it somewhere um, and the same thing applies for women so you'll see my list later on um, in a week if you come back but yeah I just need to put it somewhere and that's why I did men and women let's go on with this list so with this list I've categorized it and I also gave you some cheaper alternatives and some luxury alternatives so if you want I'll leave the timestamps down below so you know what I'm talking about throughout the video I'm gonna start off with wallets and I feel like wallets is kind of expected but the ones that I'm gonna show you might be unexpected so the first one which is a lower end um, I'm talking about a Longchamp wallet I love Longchamp I have so many of their bags um, their nylon bags their no way bags I use that every single day for work it's really good for travel as well but also their small other goods are really really nice so it comes in this little box here it comes all wrapped it doesn't have a dust bag or anything but it comes in like tissue paper and it just is wrapped like so and then it has the care instruction booklet inside but this is the wallet I'm talking about this one is the Longchamp racing and coin purse it has a slot here it has a zipper compartment down here and four credit card slots here so I really really like this you can fit a lot of things in here and you can have some coins nowadays you barely bring a wallet or not a wallet but like you have you don't have that many coins so and cards so having like just a slim sleek wallet is great and Longchamp is also awesome okay the next wallet is a little bit more expensive but you know me if you've seen my channel before, I talk about luxury stuff and I just love luxury and then I got him into luxury which I am very sorry about. Um, he blames me all the time. <laughs> it's so funny. I'm talking about a Louis piece. I absolutely love Louis Vuitton. That's what I started with. This is the pocket organizer. They have so, so many different leathers, so many different canvases, so many different prints. Um, so you pick the one that they might like themselves. He got the monogram shadow piece. I absolutely love this leather. It's super, super slim, super sleek. I absolutely love it. You open it up and here it is. So it has one, two, three pockets here and then one, two, three slip pocket and another slip pocket. Four and then five here and then at the back it has another little pocket here so it's great you can get it hot stamp I don't know there's just so many good things about this I've seen a lot of people rave about this I probably wouldn't use this myself but he absolutely adores this of course you get it in this little box um, and a dust bag as well 
Okay, next up is some camera equipment. Now, I'm not talking about lenses or buying him a camera, but I'm talking about things that you need to make it like maybe personalized. Some straps. I made these straps for him actually. So this one is a little wristlet strap. You can just hook it on to the camera and it's really, really nice to just, you know? And then if you want a longer strap, this is like a little crossbody. This one's a lot longer and then you have the two clips on the side. Or on the ends to clip it onto the camera and it's perfect for just traveling and if you want to like just take pictures wherever if you're going somewhere so this is the paracord strap and I made this out of just rope from Michaels and then all you need is these little clips I think we got them from Amazon but super super inexpensive and it's very personalized how long it it take it took me a couple hours to make but totally worth it it turned out great i'll try to find the video that i used and i'll leave it down below for you <clears throat> so you can follow along and use that as a guide if you want to make him a little strap it doesn't have to be for a camera it could be for like other things as well you think of it but yeah i think this is great so that one was a more inexpensive but if you want an expensive option this one this one is the Leica branded strap if you don't know what Leica is basically it's just a camera brand a really expensive camera brand that he absolutely loves uh, he has a Leica camera and that's why he wanted a matching strap for it and this was a little bit more expensive so basically you have the Leica branding here it's thicker on the top part and then it goes a little bit more slim on where the straps are right there and you can adjust it as you please and then of course just the hooks there next category pens so i'm not talking about regular pens like a fine point pen I'm talking about a really nice fountain pen. Now this one, Lamy Safari fountain pen. So I'll leave everything down below by the way. And this is just a really nice looking fountain pen. And then another one is like a really pretty pen. Um, and this, I don't know where he got this, but this is like really really heavy it's all metal and it has ruler here and then you open it up and there's the pen so it looks really really cool belts you know belts i feel like it's it might be expected i don't really know but i tried to compile a list you know it's very very hard but a belt very very nice this is from british belt company okay so another category will be shoes so i absolutely love my cole hans cole Haan makes such comfortable shoes these are the only shoes that i have from cole Haan, but every time i go in the store and try it out i want them so much the only reason why i haven't is because the smallest size is size five and I'm like four four and a half so RIP me but he has so many pairs of Cole Haan's I like I cannot rave you to enough these are mine these are just the uh, Grand Pro sneakers there are the tennis sneakers and these are the women's but they have the same ones in men so it's very very universal I also have an insole in them they're not this is how it looks like inside Next thing are jeans. Now, I'm talking about like real selvage jeans. There's Gap selvage jeans. They're a lot cheaper than the other ones that I'm about to tell you. Um, and they're usually on sale. So what selvage basically means, it's just raw, raw denim. And you can tell by flipping in the 
the inside and then you see a red line so that is the selvage but if you want a more expensive item you want to treat your man naked and famous um is a really really big jean company for selvage and oh my gosh we went to montreal and we went to the naked and famous store that they had it was so so nice it just goes upwards from like 200 i think 200 is like the minimum and then it just goes up by from them they have like thicker jeans so you can wear them in the winter you have thinner jeans for you the summer or fall and what's great about salvage is you don't wash them so you basically freeze them in the freezer you like put in a plastic bag and you just freeze them and that's how it gets washed and refreshed you see all the lines when you wear them because it like like mends with your knees and stuff and how you walk so it's great option and these salvage jeans last so so long and once you start wearing them a lot it fades in certain places as well and then the last thing i think is really cool is car stuff so if they have a car weathertech mats weathertech is really really great because it like it just like fits really really nicely in the mats are like specific for your car so it's not like a one size fits all no you have to like select your car i think so i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you found this helpful in any way hopefully you got some ideas unexpected gift ideas for your men in your life and i will see you in my next christmas guide which is the women so stay tuned for that bye